Hi YouTube, what I'm going to do today is take you through the simplest way of installing iOS 5 uh, Gold Master onto your iDevice. This doesn't need a developer account or a UDID, okay? but you do need to have obviously the right IPSW file for your device and if you're using Windows as I am as you can see you need iTunes 10.5 beta 7 and I'll put links in the description okay uh, I've already done my iPhone uh, so what I'm going to do is exactly the same procedure on my iPad as you can see it's on 4.3.5 okay and what I'm going to do is update it uh, to iOS 5 Goldmaster okay once you've downloaded your files as I have okay put them somewhere where you're uh, likely to be able to find them again Okay, I've got mine in a folder called iDevices. Okay, and if I change that, okay, you can see iPad 2.2 5.0 restore. Okay, make sure you get the right version. Okay, because as you know, there are GSM and other types out there. If you live in the UK, okay, it's the GSM one you need. You we don't have any other type of network over here. Okay, so what I'm going to do, my iPad is connected, iTunes is open, go into your device there on the left, okay, and what we're going to do, okay, is we're going to restore it, but we're going to hit shift, And click restore and then what we get okay is a browse box or a browse window what we need to do is browse to our file double click okay and you'll then get this iTunes will erase and restore your iPad or whatever device you're using to iOS 5 and will verify the restore of Apple I might just add now okay I have done a backup before I started doing this Okay, so it's uh, imperative that if you want to keep all your all your data and all your settings, okay, that you back up beforehand. Okay, and then I'm going to hit restore. Okay, and what it's doing now is extracting the software. Once the software is extracted, as it is now, okay, it verifies preparing the iPad. And if we look on the iPad now, okay, it's preparing the iPad to do its stuff and installing iOS 5 onto the device. Now it's just a case of waiting for iTunes and the iPad to do its thing. Okay, so the iPad's done its thing and iTunes has done its thing. What we're left with now, okay, is a window that says the i the software on your iDevice has been restored, okay, and it will restart. Leave it plugged in. Okay, so as you can see, the Apple logo, okay, and the progress bar. And there you go, iOS 5. You'll notice the new home screen, okay, because now you can uh, activate your device without having to plug it in. And now set up your iPad, set up as a new iPad, or restore from a backup, okay, and I will be restoring from a backup. However, hit the button, there we go, iPad. and configure. I hope this has helped some people. 
and I hope that if you get all of the files and you do it yourself that you enjoy iOS 5 Gold Master okay, to give us uh, a taste of what's coming next week on the 12th of uh, October. Thanks for watching.